Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can password protect OneDrive folders and files. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now on my desktop. So the first thing that you need to do guys is open the file explorer. If you don't find this right here, just go to the sort menu and then type it. Then you're going to find this right here, click on open and then you're going to be here. Right here in the left, as you can see, guys, you're going to find all of the sections. Here you're going to find Home, Gallery, and right here you're going to find OneDrive. Go to OneDrive, right-click on it, and then here you're going to find the option to copy it, expand it, open in a new tab, open a new window. Here you're going to find the option to always keep on this device, free up space, and lastly here you're going to find OneDrive. So right now, go to OneDrive, and then here you're going to find View Online, Settings, and Folder Color. Click on View Online. And then this will take you to this page on the web. Right here, as you can see, guys, in the left, you're gonna find all of the sections. Here you're gonna find my files, recent photos, shared, and lastly, right here, you're gonna find your recycle bin. Go to my files, and then as you can see, guys, right here, you're gonna find all of the files. And right here, as you can see, guys, you're gonna find your personal vault. So basically, guys, this folder is protected. You can protect it with uh, a password. So right now I'm going to click on it and then as you can see guys, in order to do that, first of all, you need to verify your identity. So for example, I'm going to send an email to my account. So right now type the code that th they sent you and then click on verify. Then just wait for it to load. And as you can see guys, right now you're going to be able to access your personal vault. So right now, if you want to protect your files, just move them here to the personal vault. For example, I'm going to go back to my files, go right here, then click on these three dots, and then here you're going to find move to. Then you can choose your personal vault, click on move here, and then you're good to go. Then click on lock right here. And as you can see, guys, right now it's locked. So this is it, guys, for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.